been doing some more to the concourse and been making the escalator going down to the metro system. Stick around and all will be revealed. Well, good afternoon everyone and welcome back to Piccadilly. Now I've done one or two bits since the last video um, but the main thrust of this video is about the escalator which is going to go down there and I'll talk to you about that in a second but let me show you one or two of the things that I've already done. Right please forgive the filming it does go out of focus it's not very much space I'm afraid but you can see I've got some of these ticket barriers in now There's just a few more to go and moving along, we have one of those digital display screens there. You can just about see that in the corner. And that is made from a piece of plastic card with the advert stuck to the front and then a piece of sellotape over the top to give the whole thing a bit of a sheen like digital equipment does. And then we've got a doorway here now with the railings coming down the side. I believe it's probably an emergency exit type doorway. Right over the first truss, you can see now we've got a glass divide and another one of those digital displays. And in the next section, I've managed to build the uh, glass section for 11 and 12. And this is the shot from the platform side and you can see the two doorways at the end. It was very difficult to get the camera in there. Incidentally, just in case um, people ask, um, the class 800 in engage is now out in the GWR livery but I've chosen not to go for that one. I'm waiting for the LNER version, um, purely because it's mainly white and I will be hoping at some point in the future, not necessarily straight away, but to be respraying that into TPE and that will take on the Nova One, I believe that is. Well, as I said before, this particular video is all about the escalator, which goes down there, which on the real station goes down to the metro or the tramway system um, so if I show you some pictures of the real thing then you get a much better flavour of what I'm trying to achieve here. Right so this is the escalator that we're trying to recreate here um, this was a picture I took back in 2018 obviously I've blotted out all the heads uh, just so that for uh, privacy sake uh, but you can see we've got the escalator going down and there's also there's glass railings coming around the side and you've also got these banners um, in varying places here as well. So um, I've got to create like a platform part which is just going to sit around the outside and then with these um, glass railings around the top. What I'll probably do is use acetate for that and then just glue a piece of um, strip or something to the top of it to indicate that railing. All right, there's two blocks, one there and there'll be another one in that corner as well. All right, so let's crack on with that bit. Oh, welcome back. That is what I'm proposing. I'll just have a show you and spin it around for you so you can see the different angles. Now, you might be thinking, well, where's the rest of it? Um, obviously, the layout has got a baseboard. As I said before, I'm going to have to cut a hole into the large concourse, which is at platform height. And then this will sit in that hole. And this area here will represent the area below and I'm hoping to find or create a photograph um, for each of these areas here to give the impression that it's going down a lot further and if possible this area this way if that makes any sense whatsoever. Um, I am going to have to create another piece coming around the top so that will go in and there'll be another piece coming down on top. Um, you might notice I've got a little lump just there I don't know whether it's the same on the other side. I did have a bit of an issue with this because you can appreciate it was quite difficult to build. Um, yeah, there is a slight one there. You can see 
So I'm just going to leave it now, to be honest with you, and just file it off. I think it would be a lot easier doing that than fiddling about trying to deconstruct all this. And yeah, so these are the parts that will sit um, just below this. This is the escalator here. So they'll sit just on top of the platform, if you like. These are the boxes. Now I'll just show you what I mean. These bits just here. And again, the other one that side as well. And this section here goes below. So this will be flipped over and these two parts will be glued together. That will be a locator. So I shall cut a hole to the outside edge of that rim. So it will literally just slot into the platform without any issues at all. Okay, right, so the next thing you'll see is when it's everything's printed. And I'll catch you up. Well, that's it as it's turned out. And you may notice I've had some bits break off. Um, not really happy with that anyway, with those holes in it. So I'm just gonna go back to traditional methods, use a bit of card on the inside of that, um, face this as well, I'm not really happy with that. Looks a little bit on the thin side. So I'll just beef it up a little bit and uh, take it from there. Well, I'll join you back in a minute. Well, there's the escalator so far. It does look a little bit rough and ready, but once everything's all glued together, it'll be a lot better, I promise. And there's the little bits going to go around the top. And there's these two boxes that are going to say lift on the side. There's some more uh, ticket barriers. And these bits here are the bits that are going to be stuck to the side, or well, down there, the inside bits there. Of course, it all needs the black... Um, rubber tracking going all the way around. That's the, the bottom bit for that bit there. All right, so we're cracking on with it and getting a bit more done. So I'll join you again in a second and we'll see what else is done. Right, you're looking at uh, the steps as they are. And what I want to do is to create an image which is gonna go in here to give the illusion that the steps are carrying on a lot further than they actually are. So the way I'm gonna do that is to search Google. Um, I'm gonna type into the uh, search engine escalator looking down, and I know there are some pictures there. Now, you might have also noticed, I'll, I'll mention this now, I haven't put the horizontal yellow lines on this one, I put vertical lines down each side. And the reason for that is because I can't, um, I can't see properly into the pictures what, what I've got. I can't see the steps. But um, what I can say is I've got a picture where there's a glimpse of one edge and it appears to have the yellow going down the outside. So I'm assuming then that the escalators would have the same. So I'm going to run with that, that thought. If it's not right, I'm really not going to worry about it. Right, welcome back. Now, you might remember this part is going to be the piece that sits into the platform. This is the lower section, and there's another bit which is going to be glued to the top of that, and then the whole of that sits on top of the steps, if you pardon the way I'm sort of uh, showing you there. Now, so what I need to do is to make a hole in, in the platform section just down there, and it's going to be 37 millimeters. I don't want it tight. Uh, by 42 millimeters. I think that will be absolutely perfect. Right, so hopefully you can see that little square now rectangle so all I'm going to do is literally just puncture a hole very gently obviously and just saw through okay I won't put you through the torture of watching me do all of that but I'll come back to you in a minute on it so hopefully that will sit nicely in there. 
different. Right, let's get it all put together. You might have noticed I've had to remove all of the uh, trusses to physically gain access to get this bit, but there we go, that's it. In now, try and show you from the different angles I can, and even from ground level. This is about as close as I can sensibly get. So get the side. It's not perfect, like I said, but it will be all right. Put everything back and see it with all and everything else in situ. So I've put some more of the ticket barriers in. I've got about another 10 or so to put in, and I'll get those done over the next week or so. Won't take long. All right, now obviously I've got a load of. Um, benches to put down here and also some signs and well loads of stuff and then what I do want to try and do is to create some kind of back scene along here because uh, obviously the cityscape isn't going to be appropriate inside the station and try and even mod model some of the um, balcony in relief I'm not sure quite how or what or where or when or anything like that. It's it's all a bit all up in the air at the minute, but it would be good to give an indication of all of that. So anyway, that's to come. And uh, I will think I'll leave the video there. So take care of yourself. Two more videos will be appearing on your screen. So please take a look at those to the very end. And I'll catch you again here very soon on Piccadilly. Bye for now.